leg limb, is he? Wow, what a shot that is. He's done it. <laughs> These are the craziest snooker shots, starting off with Ronnie O'Sullivan's super shot at the Crucible. That is a very, very fine shot from O'Sullivan. Very, very good. And what a snooker he's put him in. You know, he's teetering with going in off in the right corner, but what a shot that was. Joe Swale creates an epic moment by potting a pink on a very last second. So it's the greatest shot I've ever seen. We don't know. On the run. For me, that's in before the end. Sean Murphy's mesmerizing shot that makes everyone speechless. Well, he's coming off. No. Side cushion, top cushion, lots of right hand side. This oh, is risky. Oh, what a shot this shot. is. Oh, unbelievable. Unbelievable. What a time to play an exhibition country shot. In the World Championship of the Crucible. What a shot. Next up is Stephen Maguire's astonishing shot that astounds the snooker world. Oh. Hi, hi. Hi, hi. Where's the cue ball going? Well, have you never seen anything like that in your life? My goodness. <laughs> the most amazing shot. I think in the history of snooker has just been played. Mark Selby's electrifying shot during his 147 break left spectators in awe. Maybe looking at the double. Or even the treble. Go on, get in. Get in. What a shot. What a shot. That's what is your hot shot for the week straight away. Absolutely. In the cards, Hossein Vafaye delivers an incredible shot from the jaws of a pocket. No. <laughs> well, you won't see a better shot than that all season. What a shot that was. <laughs> Williams can't believe what he's just seen there. And that's the way to get out of a tight spot. What a pot that was. Could it be the catalyst for a change of momentum in this match? That is fabulous. That's what you call a ram -tuzzler. Next, Ding Junhui's banana shot to get on a much-needed black. Oh, who can't? <laughs> what a shot. He's actually a bit unlucky. <laughs> Don't touch that cue ball. You do yourself a mischief to spin on it. Judd Trump's jaw-dropping red during a 147 break left the audience speechless. There's only one player in the world that will be able to pot this red into the green pocket, knock the other red out and get on the black, and he's at the table now. Come on, Judd, you can do it. Oh. Wow! He's done it! He's done it! Look at the red's gone! Wow! This could be the greatest ever maximum break. Next, Ricky Walden nails a shot of the decade against the Jester. The only problem with that, it's such an easy safety shot now for Ricky. Should bring a couple of reds into play. First class. First class. Look at the two faces of the boy. Absolutely unbelievable. Ronnie O'Sullivan plays an unexpected snooker shot using a jaws of a pocket. He's trying to angle him, is he? Wow, what a shot that is. He's done it. <laughs> Ronnie O'Sullivan, 36. You need a, a sublime touch to do that. That was very clever, wasn't it? And Peter Lines escapes from the jaws of a pocket. Oh, well done. Has he got it? Marvellous. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Years of experience. What do these commentators know? Next up, Mark Allen's clever shot against the Jester in the Masters. So that the second red would swing in off the. Well, he's playing it. Oh, 
Fantastic shot. Taking the advice of Sean Murphy in the studio there. Being braver with that one. Ronnie O'Sullivan plays another genius snooker shot when he was in a trouble against the captain. Well, in the end, didn't think he could risk it. So decided to play the snooker. Wonderful. The imagination that went into that shot without hardly thinking, and as I've said before, I used to say it about Alex Higgins all the time, a snooker brain, born with it. Sean Murphy plays another craziest shot of snooker history. Bit of side, bit of side. I told you he's a magician. <laughs> Just the side that came about off the ball cushion. And Mark Selby clinches the frame and match with an incredible shot from a tight black. Might pot it. That might be the shot he's playing. Oh, he's got it. He's got it, and he's perfect on the pink. Wow, what a pot under the circumstances. In the list, Louis Heathcote's escape of the century as he pots the yellow using the jaws of a pocket. Coming to Stephen Lee's super banana shot to bring the Reds into play. But if he attempts that shot, just try and watch where he's making contact with the cue ball. Rather than on the bottom, he'd be hitting it on the top. Now there he is, so he's trying it. Oh, fantastic shot. Fantastic. Stephen Hendry's do or die tight red as he was 57 points behind against Ryan. Well, what a cheeky shot that was. But what a great shot it was. Eight. And Neil Robertson nails a unexpected opener from green to brown that leaves the commentators in awe. You know, I don't think he's even going to attempt to try and get on the brown here. I think he's just going to pot the green, play a telling safety shot. No, he's going to try and knock the brown out. Hold on. Well, would you believe it? Then he came around, I thought he was just going to play a telling safety shot, but what a shot he played there. Brilliant. Appending to Stephen Maguire's remarkable escape of snooker history against the Rocket. That could be in the pocket this time, is it? No, a little bit harder and he's got it, you know. Well played. What a shot. always been the case with it with this crowd at Wembley if you produce the goods or play a good shot you'll get the response from them Mark Selby showing the crowd what happens when he goes for a shot shot here and have a look at this cue ball 15 well, you wouldn't say it was perfect <laughs> he's gone for another trick shot well, oh no yeah oh well what about that for the finish up next, watch Mark Williams execute a brilliant shot against the Thunder on the snooker table. And if the black is in, Neil Robertson can win. Playing the cushion forest as well. Can he just... Oh, oh unbelievable! I didn't see that he could get the edge of the, the red. What an escape! Unbelievable shot. Had to be so accurate. Neil Robertson knocks in another super shot as he pots a red when he was snookered behind a pink. And hope for the best. New to hit it, four ball. He's done it, well played. Very well played. But how unlucky is Judd Trump to have left where he's planted. And you mentioned, Terry, don't put the two reds together. Mark Selby nails the decisive final black under immense pressure to complete a maximum break. Thousand pound for the maximum, four thousand for the highest break. Get in! <laughs> Get in! Get in! Get in! Ronnie O'Sullivan snookering Mark Williams on the final colours using the jaws of a pocket. Oh, this is a great shot. This is a superb shot. 
just look at Mark Williams to me the can as he walks up. You know, he appreciates what a great shot these last two snookers have been, and he's just having a little smile to the crowd there. I mean, the clever thing, obviously, using the jaws of the of the pocket to get that, and then, of course, to play the weight right is just perfect. Genius Judd Trump finds a plant in the pack of a Reds when he was snookered. <laughs> Coming up, Anthony McGill's superb shot under pressure in the World Championship. Five. That is an unbelievable pot under the circumstances. It wobbled a couple of times and his heart must have been in his mouth till he seen it drop, but that was a fabulous pot at nine all. Coming up, another Judd Trump's brilliant shot in the decider of the Masters. I think the cue ball goes towards the blue anyway, but he might be playing to the top cushion. He's tried it. What a shot! Unbelievable! What a shot! One. Opportunism at the very best, and can he knock this black in? It's not ideal. It's there! Steve Davis showcases his genius snooker brain with his unexpected snooker shot. Colleagues on the BBC, Willie Thorne in the cabin is it. He does not well eens met that sort. Rariteiten voor de dag te komen. Ja, maar het is in elk geval heel goed bekeken en heel goed voorspeld. En John Higgins' crazy IQ shot as he makes a clever move by cannoning the red with a brown. Finally, Judd Trump's commentary fooled Snooker shot against John Higgins. Oh, what a shot. This is ridiculous. Well, I described the shot, but I didn't see one. I didn't think he was going to pull it off. 